You guys saw at the end of the last video. If you didn't, I highly recommend watching it right now, but here's a little clip. What's up guys and welcome back to another video. My name is TD Bear and it is the road to this show series, the biggest up and down roller coaster of my whole life. If you guys do enjoy these videos, make sure to drop a like. I'm starting a new thing right now, okay? I'm about to ask you guys a question and I need some like paragraph answers. So I want you guys to tell me about your baseball career and then shout out your Instagram if you have one. I am going to be reading out your story, hopefully like some interesting stuff or if you have any like mailbag questions like, hey TD, I want to get better at baseball, how do I do it? Ask those questions, post your Instagram. I'll be reading out your guys's in the video. Obviously, won't have one today, uh, but make sure that make sure to drop a like on the video as well. It is about to be lit. It's the off season. This is the time, man. It is about to get absolutely crazy. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Uh, I want to change the scenery, okay? I'm about to be brutal with you guys. If for some reason I don't end up on a new team here, I'm gonna make sure I'm on a new team because I cannot be with these guys anymore. I think I did. Um, uh, that's the game. Still gotta love it though. Why am I getting a call? Sorry, just got a call in the middle of the That's the problem when you record with your phone. That's going to change, though. Uh, that's the game. Still got to love it, though. You still got to love it. You, you really do. There's nothing you can do about it. That's the exact response I'd give IRL. Um, congratulations. Okay, is this someone else? Just a warm-up to what I'm going to do next season. Okay. I need to be on a new team. I've... I've been wondering if a change might be in order. What kind of change? A change of scene, obviously. Some and I want to play shortstop. Contemplating a change of scene. Oh, the hold the cards. I might actually contract with them for a while, though. Like, like, wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. I want to see how long. What is my contract? I literally have no renew, like, at all. Like, arbitration. Like, free, four years. I don't know. Year one, year two, year three. Free age. I guess, like, I don't know how far... I'm like into the nice year. I'm like, I'm 22 years old. I'm pretty sure I came to when I'm 18. This is my fourth off season. I've won one world series in this time. Let's see what they had to offer me. Probably something just ridiculous. If I know them 800 and not even a mil. Can we make it a cool mill Chicago? And I both, I, I walk out a millionaire. You walk out with the best third baseman in the league. 882. No, I don't want to sign with you for 882. You know what? I'll do it. Whatever. They're, they're, they're not, they're not going to sign me. I, can I not sign a contract anymore? Th I would have accepted anyways. Apparently I can't sign a contract a anymore. Scene. die a hero or you live long enough to see yourself become the villain oh my gosh oh my I said that I didn't think they'd actually deal me though I honestly did not and I am low-key like a part of me to put on the pinstripes and represent like I hate like I don't hate the Yankees. Like, I don't hate Yankees fans. I've actually met Aaron Judge. Um, if you guys who didn't know, I've actually really interviewed Aaron Judge. Really, really nice guy. We are going to be on the Yankees, though. Oh, my gosh. Man, that is absolutely insane. It's insanity that that's just happened. It is really, truly insanity that that is something that just went down. I honestly just can't believe it. I really, genuinely cannot believe that that went down. Word just came from upstairs, right? You've been like, I... Oh, the New York, I'm going to be in pinstripes, baby. I'm about to be in pinstripes. Oh my gosh. Of course I have. Oh, wow. That is, it's actually low key hype. I don't even care. I know you have this actually game store. You have to live it out. This seems, a, um, it's fine. They have banks where the Yankees play too. What does that even mean? Just like where I can get money. I hope to see a career back. flourish with the Yankees of all the teams. Okay. Of all the unexciting teams. That I could have gotten, I could have gotten traded to the Reds. The thing I'm excited for is it's an exciting team. It's a new situation. I'm gonna be playing with Judgment Day. Like I could have gotten traded to like the Athletics, the Yankees. Oh my gosh! 
This player has again been traded <laughs> to one major league. Oh, we're trading a one to the Yankees. Oh my gosh. I'm happy to be here. Thank you. I really am. We think you have a game. That's why I brought you here. Welcome to New York. It's been waiting for you. Welcome to New York. Welcome to New York. Welcome to New York. It's been waiting for you. Oh my gosh. Life's crazy. They legit dealt me. I, we lost and they legit were like, let's just throw this guy to the curb. This team is stupid. This team is stupid. Look at us. Me, Judge, Stanton, the greatest baseball team ever put together. Ever. Like, I don't know why I couldn't play shortstop, though. I'm going to ask at some point this year to play some shortstop. But look at me in the pinstripes. I've actually been uh, to Yankee Stadium. got a full tour, like kind of a VIP tour type thing. It was six. And I number 11? If I'm on number 11, I'm sold on the Yankees. I never want to leave. I never want to leave if I'm on number 11. And I got awards, too. What are the, the awards are locked. Oh, my gosh. Holy. This just life comes at you fast sometimes, guys. Life just hits you really really fast and you end up on probably the most stacked team in the league they have two uh, like uh, the best power hitters and then me like it's gonna be me leading off and then Stanton and Judge behind me it's about to be just absolutely straight up bananas on this squad and when I say that oh my god I just can't even believe it let's play some let's play some stuff like I'm hitting sixth but I don't even care I'm not even mad I'm not even mad at all. I'm hitting sixth. I'm happy about it. Like, it's almost like, okay, Yankees, bat me sixth. I'm fine with that. That's cool. Bat me ninth. I really don't care. I'm just on a new team. And I, to be honest, if I'm, like, just giving my truthful opinion on the White Sox, I was getting burnt out with the White Sox. I think you guys were getting burnt out of watching the White Sox. I think it was a mutual thing all around where we all were very, very burnt out with that team. Um, so I think a change of scenery was definitely in order. And seeing me in a Yankees uniform now in the first ever video of Road to the Show this year, I put myself in a Yankees uniform for like a thumbnail and legit, it happened. Do you think it was foreshadowing? Like, I don't know guys, is that, I, I think it may have been foreshadowing. Nope, come on, get there, not quite. That sucks. A little slow on that one, it's cool. It's cool, we're playing Detroit and their ugly, ugly uniforms. The only thing that can make this better is if I become, you guys gotta drop a like for this. I need to become the shortstop for the New York Yankees. I need to become Derek Jeter 2.0. I'll play against the Blue Jays. In this, in like real life, I'm a Jays fan. In Road to the Show, I'm an MLB player. I don't care, they're paying me big, big bucks. You better believe when I become a free agent for New York, they're gonna be paying the man his money. And I'm staying in the AL, I'm gonna get to play Boston a lot, I'm gonna get to play the Blue Jays a lot, like all the teams that I like watch every single day. And I say, and I say let's get it boys. First hit as a New York Yankee. And if we're balling out in New York, if we're balling out in the Big Apple, you better believe something. You better believe something. I'm about to go and have, like, the coolest stuff. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Did I click a button? I'm so happy it's preseason. I literally was just sellying about the trade and I clicked a button. It is what it is. It's all good in the hood. Don't judge me. I know you're mad at me. Just try and be like half as mad at me as you are and everything will be fine. Let's get it. Oh my gosh. I'm a New York Yankee. What? All I can say is like if you would have told me when I started this offseason that I would end up being on the Yankees, I would have told you you were crazy. And like management literally just dumped me for nothing. It's the shocking thing that continues to happen to me is where the White Sox just don't see that much value in me. They're just like, oh, it's just Barrett, like, throw him away. And this continues and continues to happen. And it sucks, it really does. Now a bunt attempt here. Nice throw. Nice job, nice throw, oh my gosh. That's arm strength, man. That's some baseball IQ coming right there that is some baseball iq okay bottom of the sixth runner on first you're seeing me in the pinstripes which is just i don't even know how to describe it i feel like there's gonna be a lot of really pumped up people in the chat right now like a lot of really really happy people because they have one of the biggest fan bases in the league they also have one of the biggest like haterships in the league i don't even know if that's a word hatership i feel like it's not like the patriots i would say have the biggest hatership in football and the Yankees 
are like a close second in baseball. And I think in spring training, yeah, they make you go back to clubhouse every single time, which is so painful. I do want to play two or three preseason games, though, just to kind of get used to everything, see how we look, um, get ready for opening day, which is going to come out at 2,000 likes. So drop a like if you want to see the kid next to Judgment Day in Stanton. And we can definitely go ahead and make that happen. The coolest shortstop in baseball is straight chilling. Well, this time I'm leading off. Okay, that's something a little bit different. What was I going to talk about? Okay, sports in general. This The last part of this video is going to be my take on sports. And it's a little different than some people, but I don't take sports too seriously. Um, in my mind, like, I am a diehard Titans fan. I would, to have them, like, when they win, and, like, same with the Blue Jays, I honestly love that team. But when, like, I'm not the type of person who would ever, like, I, I would say I lose sleep, or I used to a lot. But the thing about sports is, and I, this is what I'm trying to say, I never hate on fans. I make jokes. I say the Yankees are overrated to get a reaction. But just just think about this. And you guys are going to understand why I make like jokes about other teams. And I can take them when people make jokes about the Blue Jays. Because I think that's kind of what makes sports special. Just imagine a world where everybody liked the same team. Let's say the Orioles. And it's funny because I'm saying the Orioles. Imagine a world where literally every single person was an Orioles fan. Would sports still be fun to watch? I want to say I know what your answer will be. No, probably not as fun to watch because everyone likes the same team. You just, you all win, which is never as exciting. Part of what makes sports, to me, so fun, so exciting, and just so absolutely amazing is the fact that we have people that like different teams. If there wasn't Yankees fans and Red Sox fans, there would be no satisfaction for me when the Blue Jays would win. If you guys un un sort of understand what I mean, I wouldn't get the same level of satisfaction because it's just different. In general, it's like, so that's my whole theory on sports. I never take it too seriously because in my mind, it's a game, but I also I'm not the type of person I'm like, you can't take it, like, I love sports. I really, really genuinely do. It's my job. I want to work my whole life around sports, and I really believe that, like, and by taking it seriously, let me explain what I mean. Being upset when they lose, completely fine. Loving your team, spending money on your team, completely fine. But letting it ruin, like, certain aspects of your life, like, I would never be, like, get so upset at a sporting outcome where I, like, treat other people poorly or I, like, me and my girlfriend went to the Titans-Patriots game, okay? The P Titans obviously lost, but, like, in general, like, that was okay because I was still spending time with her and we still had a ton of fun. At the end, even after the game, I was laughing and stuff because in the, in the end, I got... I was blessed to be able to go watch that. I love that team. Sure, I was bummed out, but like, there was a bunch of Titans fans in the parking lot, and we were all just yelling, tighten up. And it was just tighten up, tighten up, tighten up. And like, we just got beat bad by the Patriots. And then I also went to the Super Bowl, in case you guys don't know that. Saw the Patriots lose, kind of felt good to see that live as well. Um, and a little, little part of me. Um, but my girlfriend knows nothing about sports. Like, literally, my whole life is sports. She knows less than nothing about it. So for me, it was really interesting to see her at that little event because she's never been to like a sporting event. And she doesn't know a, like a touchdown from a field goal from a quarterback to a D lineman. But the one thing, and even though it was freezing, she said it was super fun to feel a community around me. And she loved that every single time we saw yeah, Titans fans, they'd yell Titan up. And she had a little Titans jersey on. It was super baseball. cute. And that's part of, like, that's just how I see sports in general. So if I ever make fun of your team or say anything, please try not to get offended. Feel free to come back at me with jokes about the Blue Jays. I find that friendly banter fun. When I meet people um, who like, and if you guys are wondering why I'm wearing a Cardinals hat, this is my NL team. Uh, and I played on them in front of the show. Part of what made them my NL team. I also liked them a little bit before. And I like the hat. So you're probably going to see a lot of this hat in future videos just because I like kind of the curvature of it. I just think it's a nice hat. And it's comfy. It's, it's got some good coverage. So that's my opinion on sports. I cannot wait for my debut. I might even record that tonight as well. It'll probably be up tomorrow during the day. We're about to just keep pumping out the road to the show because it's baseball season. I love baseball. And then the pitcher road to the show. I might do three today. I'm thinking about doing two of these in the morning and then a pitcher and first home run as a Yankee that's going to go deep, far to the right. Put the hand up, stand up. Hand up, stand up. Welcome to the Yankees, sir. Welcome to the New York. Now back the top of the lineup, stepping in. Now batting. Barrett, Barrett, All the Yankees. Number two. Into the Derek. From the stretch. Jeter, Jeter, Jeter. Right 
Bizarre Number two. Horse, that's the Yankees commentary. That's that's how he did the announcing for Derek Jeter. He'd say, now batting for the Yankees. So Number two. Derek Jeter, Jeter, Jeter. Well, boys, I'm going to sim to the opening day. Make sure we don't get traded again before that, because if I get traded again, then all my talk about the Yankees being a little bit excited to play with Stan and Judge is just going to be all for naught. It's going to just be a complete and total waste of time, and I'm going to be upset about it. But I'm an 83 overall, Mr. Reliable, trying to make it to the Hall of Fame, trying to do great things, trying to stay healthy this season. You guys saw it happen last year. I got hurt, it wasn't pretty, but you always want to sim spring training just in case for the next video because I do not want to get traded again. I would literally be sick if that happened. Spring training has come to an end, advance the regular season. Yes, here we are, and we are playing the Blue Jays. I will see you guys in the next video. Drop a like, hit subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, and I'll see you guys then.